Howdy, hey folks. Today, we are gonna have a crankbait, a mini crankbait party. I've just found two little baits here at this site. And we're gonna try to grab them and see what we can catch. Let's do it. Whoa, uh -oh. I'm seeing something else over here before we get that one. Let's take a peek at this real quick. Is it another mini crank I see? Oh no, it's a spinner. I think it's a spinner. It looks weird, I don't know what it is. Let's see if we can grab it real quick. Oh, it might just be a soft plastic. Oh man, it's got some stout line on it. Don't know what that was. Whoa, look at that crazy plastic. Huh, there you go. Okay, back to mini crank fest. This one over here looks to be a grasshopper. I'm coming in way too hot. Oh yeah. A lot of line here too. Let's see if we can clean some of that up. There's that guy. Okay. Good to get all that line out of there. Let's go get our other crankbait and start fishing. Whoop. Gonna have to take a detour. I see another lure up here. Let's see what we got here. Looks like a lipless crankbait. Let's see if we can get him pulled out of here. Woo! Sweet deal. Oh, it's a big one. Look at that guy. No name on it. Looks like it's been there for a while. The hooks are a little rusty. Pretty sweet. Oh man, I'm seeing another, uh, what looks like a Rapala up here. Ooh, let's check this out. See if I can pull myself over to it. Ooh, without cutting my hands off. The wind is really fighting me today. Okay, let's see if we can get into this thing's hooks. Yes, we got him. Okay, now I can let go of this line. Wow, there's a lot attached to this. Cheaper spots. Golly, all that line. was it just attached to this guy. And there's still more on him here. Let's see what we got. Nice. A Rapala slow sinking. Golly, I can't read it. I'll have to look it up. Very sweet. Okay, the mini crank is right here. Oh, let's see if we can get it before the current pulls me away yes we got it awesome man i made a few passes at that and it was uh not happening awesome sweet look at that little dude Alrighty, now that we've got all that line sorted out, let's uh, just fish them in order that we found them. See what we can catch. All right, let's see what this guy's action looks like. It sinks, probably because of my swivel clip. Got a nice little wobble. What's not to want? Yes! Woo! 
Ooh, first fish of the day. Here we go. There we go. Sweet. And that's why I usually net a uh, tiny fish, especially when treble hooks are involved, because they always pop off and make me look like a fool. Okay, we're not gonna deal with that right now. Look at this pretty guy. Man, he's gorgeous. Whoop. And there he goes. <laughs> there you go. They're gonna make me a fool anyways. Whoa. Oh boy, that feels pretty good actually. We'll see what that is. Goodness gracious. Yep, yep, yep. He's pretty good. Come on now, buddy. Come on. Whoa, man. <laughs> Holy cow. This net is not big enough for him. Holy cats. What a nice bass on such a tiny crank. Holy cow. <laughs> that is incredible. Man. You know what they say, big fish, big baits, or whatever. Man, what a gorgeous fish. Sweet deal. All right, we are solidly on the board now. <laughs> That's awesome, man. <laughs> man, this canoe smells so fishy, and I am not mad about it. That is so awesome. Let's give this uh, lipless crank a try. I think it's a little deeper right here, but I don't think it can be too, too deep. So good chance we're gonna lose it. Okay, I just Googled this and it is a R Rapala Shadow Wrap 11 slow sinking. So that's the name of this guy. Let's see what it does. I'm gonna guess it probably sinks slow, maybe. Uh, yeah, there it goes. It's got a great action though. Let's see what we can do with it. Oh man, looks like we might have a spicy noodle over here. Let's give it a look. What flavor are you, spicy noodle? Look at him. Oh, you want to play? No, I don't think you do. <laughs> Spooky. I wonder what flavor he was. Oh, nope, that snagged. Shoot. And the wind is so brutal out here. It's gonna be really easy to snap myself off here. I do not want to lose this guy because he's so pretty. Yes, ha -ha! victory. Okay, we're gonna be more careful with this guy now. Nope, no, oh, snagged again, daggum. Okay, so we can all just agree that this one's definitely cursed. There we go. Okay, since we've since we've established that this one is cursed, let's move on to our last little lure. This little tiny crank. I'm excited to see what this does since we caught that large bass on the uh, little cricket lure. Let's see, it's kind of. This massive swivel clip is really kind of killing its uh, action, but let's see what it does. Oh, okay. Well, first cast with it. I guess it's doing pretty good. What? <laughs> I think it was, <laughs> it must have been a piece of log or just broke off on that log, man. It really felt like a fish. Getting nibbles. Maybe the tiny hooks are too tiny? 
Who knows? Oh, I might need to let him chew on it a little bit more. Missed that one too. This is the lure. If you just want to get nibbles, you don't want to actually get fish in the boat. This is a perfect lure for you. Well, folks, it's about all I have time for right now. I'm gonna fish this. I'm gonna fish this little crank back to the car. I'll let you know if I see anything. But until next time, I'll catch you later.